I mean, how much artistic liberty did Ryan and the team give you? Did they kind of just say, run wild with it, try whatever, or were you really honed in on a script? I would say we had some liberty. What's great about the horror genre is you can kind of justify a lot of choices. I think I would try, I would try things, and most of the time they were like, great. Like, you know, I just remember when we are in episode two, I think, and Father Charlie and I are having, you know, a will they, won't they moment. And we got a note from Ryan on a walkie talkie going 50% weirder and more sensual. And we were like, okay, like 50%'s a lot, you know? And I just looked at Nick and I was like, this is gonna be different. And he's like, go, like, go at it. And I was like, okay. And I like, I like remember spitting and like, <laughs> like putting my hand in his mouth and just, and they were like moving on and when you hear moving on you're like all right well we did something right it's those moments like that that wasn't in the script of course but i think ryan was like seeing something and then wanted to build on it and so we kept going and going and those are the those that moment of creation is so fun actually it's like what i that's why i do it speaking of those scenes with nick uh I've seen so many, I don't know how in the weeds you are on grotesquery TikTok, grotesquery Twitter. Uh, I just saw an edit the other day that it was it was you and him in that scene and the caption was, wish it was me. How does it feel to have the entire internet jealous of you in this moment? <laughs> it's so funny because I used to watch, I always watch interviews with actors all the time, but there's, you know, people are always like, sex scenes are, aren't sexy. And I would be like, okay, you know. They're not <laughs> like, all I remember is, <laughs> can we rig the underwear to come off in an easier way? <laughs> you know, like you're asking bizarre questions. And I don't know, I, Nicholas is the loveliest and we had so much fun. It was like three in the morning. We were so at a loss for like what we were doing with our lives. We like had ice cream like three minutes before our like naked sex scene. <laughs> You know, I think it's so fun to like watch someone blow up. You know, he's having such a moment right now and I'm so happy for him. And we had so much fun with those scenes, obviously. Like those are the types of scenes you read and you're like, this is gonna be a blast. Like what's, this dynamic is so confusing for her. There's so much shame built in around this sexual tension and I think everyone can relate to that in some way, this like push pull of like, I want this, but shouldn't, whether or not you're a, you're in Catholicism or not.